How to use PancakeSwap on an iPhone using a Trust Wallet. So first thing you want to understand guys, so there are a few tokens that are not available for making this swap. So in this case, I'm going to go into swap and what I can do, maybe I want to select the VMV and I want to swap this for, I don't know, let's say cake token. So as you can see, I don't have this option available here on Trust Wallet. So that's the reason why we use something called pancake swaps to make those kind of swaps of different assets that cannot be swiped in the Trust Wallet application. So what you guys want to do is to go back, I'm going to hit into done, and I'm going to go into browser. So what I want to do where it says search all into website is that I want to select the option that says pancake swap that finance uh slash swap so as you can see down in here i already have on my history the um application so what you guys want to do is to hit on enter but in that case i'm just going to go into my history and after that it's going to be uh opening a new tab inside the trust wallet so as you can see i have uh this already opened so this one is going to be sending you for the first time something like this connects your wallet so i'm going to go into connect and what you guys want to select is your trust wallet. So after that, you're going to see that your asset has, has now been added correctly into PancakeSwap. So as you can see, I have my VMV, the token that I wanted to make the swap for. So maybe you want to select some Ether and change that for Pancakes. So as you can see, Pancake is now already available into that. Maybe you want to select, I don't know, maybe one of those. And this is what I want to receive. So after that the last thing you want to do is to select this option that says enable ether so this one is going to be sending me a smart contract call so i can be changing my smart chain my vmv from my main wallet and send that into pancakeswap.finance to make the swap for uh the cake token so after that let's go and have just a little bit more of smart chain vmv to cover the network fees just in case that you don't have that available you need to have this in order to make the fee so after you finish with the trade you want to go and exit the page and you want to go back into your wallet and see that your assets are now being converted into the token that you want to be receiving so there you have it guys it wasn't that hard and actually guys if you want to earn a few coins in here you can go into forms and pools of cake vmv so you can go and even win a few trading competitions predictions and the lottery and you can see uh of course nfts within the uh pancake swap of the nft market so there you have it guys thank you for watching the video don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more about charles wallet and i'll be seeing you guys on the next one